It's a mock exercise to assess how prepared the Independent National Electoral Commission is for this month and March elections. For those who are present for the exercise at Ward 15 in Okorozo Playground, Rumosi of Obiakwa local government area in River State, this INEC official educates them and observers on the sequence of voter accreditation. After that, a voter undergoes accreditation either by fingerprint or facial recognition, hence the term by model. For me, I'm okay because the, when they started, they brought a, a beaver that is not from this unit. When we made the report, they changed it immediately and brought the beavers for this unit. And I understand that this unit has, because of the population, has two A and B of unit one. And in my presence here, we voted. We have, we have seen somebody that through the, that, that they captured through the face. I've seen another person they captured through the fingerprint. I've seen one again they captured through the through the scanning of the of the voter's card, and they voted normally. So what we are waiting presently is to see the transmission of the of the program so far. A similar exercise is taking place here in Ibadan, the Bad on the Ayo State Capital. The resident electoral commission and an observer are satisfied with the outcome. It's a test fit across all these polling units to showcase to Nigerians the functional roles of these beavers, which involve the authentication and the the the, the, the voting procedures in the recent how it's going to be taking place comes 25 February 2023. As I speak, virtually everybody that has even cast their votes here, they did it successfully. So far, so good from the beavers machine, right, from the accreditation process, which is about three, right? The first one is the thumbprint, the second is the facial, and the third is about the six last numbers are the VIN. So it works very well. And another thing that I see that I'm so happy about is that the beavers is not connected to any sort of network. What the beavers works with are the number of registered voters that has been implanted into the beavers machine. In Abel the Ogun State Capital, the mock accreditation exercise is taking place here in one one Unit 3 Centenary Hall, like here in Abel Kuta South Local Government Area, one of the six councils selected for the exercise, and it witnesses a relatively good turnout. <laughs> The officials also give an assessment of the exercise. Well, what we realize here is that um, the accreditation has been very fast, very fast. It's taken an average of a minute per uh, voter to be accredited. And I think that's com really commendable. You see, this is a trial run. I is expected to indicate what the real one will be like. So all things being equal, I expect the actual access to also be as seamless as this one has proved to be. Besides minor glitches, the consensus here shows that it takes an average of one to two minutes turnaround time to get a voter accredited, and everyone expects INEC to sustain the success of the mock exercise on the day of election.